fucking the NFL. This is what we're talking about, Jess. Don't get upset. Get on the mic. Put those headphones on. Let's get on this mic, right? The NFL, yeah. A bunch of greedy fucking truffle pigs. Let me fucking tell you about them. These fucking guys, right? Apparently, they're in talks for an 18-game season. Not 18-week. 18-game. One more than they have now, which they have a 17-game season now. But now they want to have... An 18 game. They want to add an extra game. Mm-hmm. And, you know. You're not with it? N- I mean, listen, I'm a football fan, so I like football. Right? I like the NFL, especially, right? More money for the players. More money for the players. Maybe the salary cap, it already jumped up this year, so maybe it could jump up again in the next couple of years if they do this, right? TV deals get signed, right? More money being made. Mm-hmm. But I thought we cared about the players. <laughs> what about the NFL PA? What do the Players Association have to say about this? If the PA does this, I'm never taking another player seriously about health concerns ever again. Well, I'm never I feel doing like, it. well, realistically, the players, even if it's strongly, if they feel strongly against it, do they really have that much control over it? No. And I think the teams are just going to have to find another way. So I think if you extend it one more game, it's definitely going to change a lot of things because at this point now you're going to have to think about like possibly like splitting your season to avoid all the health injuries. You may have to rotate your starting lines a few, you know, a few different times. Somebody said um, so. It'll give ch- and it's possible that it'll give chance to people who are usually sitting. Yeah, but here's the thing: you want to play your best players, y'all. You do want to win. play your best players, but you're talking about another game now, so. They don't have to like split like five games, six games, but like maybe two, three games out the season. You gotta that's, let that's your... a lot, yo. Two, three games decides a season. Two, three games, but that's eighteen the division. games. You're, you're telling me the now the injuries are just gonna skyrocket. So you but, have well, to do well, something. Well, obviously the NFL doesn't care about it. So who? So I don't care about it. I don't care about it anymore. I don't, don't want to hear. Maybe any... one game they can rest. You can sacrifice one game. Have NFL players said anything about this? What can they say? They have the weakest. The weakest player union throughout the major leagues. Well, so it's I like, what? well if, if yeah, the player yeah, union accepts Daniel. it, I don't care. Forget that. Yeah. Fuck them. Yeah. I just love how we just complained about MLB having one season, two games, <laughs> and now you're complaining about 18 games? I'm complaining about it. Well, it's a different it. type of game. It's a it's different, a different, different type, type of game. It's a... Here's the thing. You want to know why? They get hit every play every play the, the yeah. cte numbers are going to skyrocket and in the next baseball 25 games years. you can there's you know there's two games in one day for baseball that happens you have a double header so you can't do that with you football can't do that players. with football imagine that no i think you may have to have a game at one then if a game you at add eight. one more game to that schedule you're gonna have to really I th- as two by weeks you're gonna have to exactly you need two by weeks exactly so if you're not going to switch up your start if you're not going to rotate players to keep some healthy then you're going to have to have two by weeks you have to and I agree. I think that should be that should be the line. Then you have to give us a second bye week. There's no questions about it. Otherwise, you know, the only way the players can stop this is if, like, say they implement the 18th game and they just don't play. That's the only way you're going to do it. Because most players who don't get the big contracts are going to be all for this 18th 100%. game. 100%. Because they need all the bread as possible. But that's what I'm saying. Your, your starters, they're going to need a break. Because they already got the bread, and now you're asking them to pay with their bodies. So it's yeah. like, yeah. Um. So every team plays 17 games? Yes. That's how that works? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I thought it was just like 17 games the entire season. Everybody's just like, ah. <laughs> if you play, you play. If you don't play, ah. No. Each team has a 17-game schedule. Okay. Just checking. Lord. Thanks, guys. I'm going to be addressing this in my in my podcast. Don't worry me yet. I don't know why you giggling. You know I don't watch sports. <laughs> yeah, can you knock it off? What, so, Miad, when we talk about multiple games during a week, <laughs> what do you think? There's just like, oh, no, this is special? I figured, but I was just like, let me double check. She, she was unaware about oh. the schedule. Relax. <laughs> let me double check. Oh, it's so f- uh, that, I'm that ha- funny. I'm happy that she asked us instead of just assuming that for the rest of her life. Thanks, and then guys. Saying uh, it, every and saying Jess. It yeah. See, Jess is always on my side. Listen, Lewis there's no such thing like, as a stupid you know question. What, yeah. 17 games a year would be caught a fire. Imagine that, <laughs> right? Only 17. You would have to go by lottery. You would have, uh, yo, and honestly, some teams just don't play. Some team plays five times. You played zero. You don't even get a chance to win the rig. No, I think an 18th game would be, I'm not against it, sort of. What? 
I don't think so. Yo, come on. We're going through the football drought right now. It sucks. It's already been like almost a month without football, and I'm already like. What is adding on. one more week going to do for that football drought? I don't. It's one less week without football. It's one less week with football. I mean, well, come on. Two, oh my gosh. Okay. Now I'm now if they keep a 17, I won't be mad at that either. I won't be mad or either way they go. Because you can't have you can't take away the the first round buy for the first but seed. You, but the NFL they're expand like they're doing really well in expanding the sport. So they're and that's going to allow them an extra game overseas. And I think that's the long term thing here. Oh my god! Nobody oh. cares about Munich. They want them Nobody to, they, cares they, about they, they can NFL use this Switzerland. Game overseas. Nobody they cares can fit about that game you. in there somewhere. Nobody cares about what else NFL would this be? Poland. They're, they're expanding. No the money's coming cares. in. They raise the, the salary Europeans cap. Don't give give a fuck about us. <laughs> Europeans don't give a fuck about us. But this is I don't know. Maybe the dollars are saying something else. And that's why they're considering it. That's why they're pushing so hard. So maybe this 18th game, they'll finagle it where it's like, you know, it'll be an overseas, so, and that'll be the only game for the week. And if that'll be Patrick everyone Patrick Mahomes else's doesn't want to do it, <laughs> the league's not doing it. If Patrick Mahomes puts on Twitter, like, I ain't playing no 18 games, I guarantee you. Or maybe they he's do like, it. hell yeah, give me all the games. I don't know. Some well, play, I'm the, telling you, some players want the extra game. Well, technically, that means less per check. No. Yes, it does. Literally, means they're going to ask for more money if they're going to play an 18th game. There's only so much salary cap. Sorry, only so much. But I don't you think they've already only addressed so this? If they're already talking about it, they're already. That means they're willing to pay the players an extra game. Debatable. Debatable. Yeah. Have you met the NFL owners? <laughs> well, <laughs> have the, you met? You know Jerry? how much it would be to spend to actually put on an 18th game. So if, for them to really consider it, obviously it's making sense to them dollar wise. If the salary this really comes no. down to what oh. the players are going to do. You know do. what it is? Because I just figured out the math. Some teams want the extra home game because now, now the 17th game, one team gets an extra home game a year, which is more money for them. That's what I'm saying. It all comes that, down to profits. That's why it comes but the fucking owners, because they want the extra game, because they want to make the money. Because that's what you do when they you're a billionaire. You find ways to make more revenue. NFL, they don't care about y'all. They know that NFL already. Players, they don't care about they y'all. They know bro. that. They're, no NFL player is under, the, is under the, the impression that his owner truly cares. None of them. None of them. He cares for you as, much, as far as he can throw you. A means to an end. And you can treat them the same way. This is a business. Of course they don't care about me. They've been trying to hide CTE for over a decade. Like, they don't care. Junior say This is all about money. That's all I got to say. This is all about football culture. And I just think you have the players. It's really going to come down to how the players handle it and how what the coaches say. How far do you think Jerry Jones can throw Dak Prescott? <laughs> Not very far because he's still on the team. So... Clearly not. Uh, <laughs> he's still there. I don't know. It, only if the salary cap goes up to like two eighty. That can happen. It's already look. That hey, can we, happen. We might just go to baseball and have no salary cap. You know what? Yeah, that, that would, could no that could because happen. then it's gonna be three big teams. The Giants might have start being good again. People are gonna <laughs> go to the Cowboys, the Rams, the Forty ers Excuse me. No, actually, and the Broncos. They, they don't want to play in California. Why money. would you want to play all those taxes? Go to Georgia. No, you want to be Florida. No, you want to be in California. You got the sun all year round. Go to Florida. Well, it's parts warm of California, weather. not all of California. You better like to go to the Miami. Better go to Miami. Yeah. Tampa. I mean. They're ain't, winning. Ain't nobody coming to New York. Too no. cold. It's way too cold. And then taxes? Ain't no it's way. way. It's way. It's terrible here. Ain't no way. I love New York. <laughs> <laughs> but here's the, like, listen, I'm a football fan, so obviously I want to see more football. So now, do I. The first, you want to know the first question I had for this debate? I was like, how will this affect fantasy? <laughs> oh, my God, fantasy! Yellowstoners, another game for me to come up. Yes, 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 yes. How yes, will yes. this affect my fantasy projections? Yes. Like, now I can't pick CMC because he's not going to play week 17 or 18. <laughs> right? No, but maybe they'll have someone else in the lineup that's pretty damn good. But I want CMC. Well, CMC, he's got to play. I don't know, man. Don't Disgusting. Know. Absolutely deplorable. Is it fair? No, but is no, it's it, not it, is, it is what it is. It is it's, what it's, it is. It's, hey, but it's... Is it fair to the pockets? Yes. Yes, of course. But is it not fair to my brain? No. <laughs> I mean, it's up to the players. You're going to have these players retiring more early if you have this now. 